through to Cabinet, Mr Speaker. Question number 10, Angie Warren Clark. Thank you, Mr Speaker. My question is to the Minister of Research, Science and Innovation and asks, what recent announcements has she made regarding kauri dieback and myrtle rust research? The Hon. Dr Megan Woods. Mr Speaker, last week I announced surged funding for critical research that will provide new knowledge to help manage the impacts of these diseases, protect our taonga species and deliver on our coalition agreement. Additional new funding of $13.75 million over three years for kauri dieback and myrtle rust research and $8.75 million will be directed to kauri research and $5 million for myrtle rust research. Supplementary. Uh, why is new research necessary? Mr Speaker, the current knowledge and tools are not enough to manage Cody dieback and myrtle rust, and this government is committed to an effective response to these diseases. Research is critical as it identifies and enables new ways of managing and controlling the pathogens. We need new knowledge and approaches if we are to slow the spread and protect our taonga species and ecosystems. The funding will go to the Biological Heritage National Science Challenge, working in partnership with order, Mana Whenua. Order, order. The member has, was well finished answering the question. Supplementary. What new areas of research will this funding support? Mr Speaker, the funding will build our understanding of the pathogens that cause myrtle rust and kauri dieback, how they spread through New Zealand's forest ecosystems. Results will be applied to breeding programmes to enable disease resistance. Question number 11, the Honourable Michael Woodhouse. Thank you, Mr Speaker. My